15 Fortnite collabs everyone wants. If I told you that you'd be able to roll up the Tilted Towers in a Tesla Model 3, you'd probably be super confused, but in Fortnite, things like this are normal. And it wouldn't be the craziest thing to expect a Tesla and Fortnite collaboration in the future. We could even take it further and add the new Cybertruck. This definitely fits the aesthetic of Fortnite's vehicles way more. Not only do we have a crossover with Ferrari, but this could go way beyond just a car. They could add the man himself, Elon Musk. Running around as Elon of Fortnite will be the most ridiculous thing ever. I mean, please add this one, Epic. Sonic has been in Minecraft, Mario, and Lego, but still, for some reason, we haven't seen anything from him in Fortnite. With the new Sonic 2 movie, we were hoping that someone would make an appearance, but there's nothing. Of course, Sonic himself would be amazing in Fortnite. We had our doubts, but as you can see, it actually kind of works. We'd also love to see Knuckles in the game, and along with Tails, it could be an insanely cool Fortnite set. But when it comes to Dr. Robotnik, that's where things get interesting. We would love to see Jim Carrey's version of Robotnik in the game, but if we did want to pay homage to the original, then what better way than to add the Eggmobile. Anything's possible in Fortnite, so why not? And while Sonic is a huge franchise, there's an even larger one out there that would absolutely break the internet. Pokemon is the biggest franchise on the entire planet. It makes more money than Star Wars and Marvel combined. So why isn't it in Fortnite yet? Everyone wants to see Pokemon around the island. There will be nothing as cool as a huge Charizard walking around the map. Epic knows how popular Clombo is, so imagine if next season we had a Charizard. And of course, it wouldn't be a massive collab if they didn't add a Pokemon themed POI. It would be amazing to battle each other in a stadium or walk around town seeing wild Pokemon. There are so many possibilities, which is why players are desperately wanting to see a Toy Story collab. As we know, the new Lightyear movie is about to release and there will be no better time to drop a Toy Story crossover. But not all collabs have to just be cosmetics. We would kill to see a Buzz Lightyear Wings Mythic. It could work like a wingsuit or a jetpack. Either way, it would be awesome. If we wanted to move out of the Lightyear movie and into Toy Story, then a Woody skin would fit perfectly into the game. And there are way more characters in the films than that. The problem is they all come in different shapes and sizes, but we have a solution. We could turn characters like Mr. Potato Head into a back bling, or maybe even a pet. Rex would also work in this format, and if we really wanted to go with something iconic, then the little green men would sell like hotcakes. And speaking of toys, we were all surprised that Fortnite still hasn't added Transformers into the game. Epic and Hasbro have been working together for years. Together, they've dropped Nerf guns, Monopoly sets, and the Snake Eyes skin. But we're still waiting for Transformers to come to the island. Having Optimus Prime and Fortnite just seems like a dream. I mean, Fortnite already has trucks and it has mechs, so why not combine the two? He would work well as a normal vehicle, and he's huge when in robot form, and I guess the same could be said for Bumblebee. And you know what? There actually is a chance we get a collab like this. Hasbro is very close to Epic, but for something that we could also see this year, there's Harry Potter. The latest Fantastic Beast movie just came out and Hogwarts Legacy is releasing this year. It's the perfect time for a crossover and when you wonder what could be included, we are all thinking the same thing. A Hogwarts POI is at the top of everyone's wish list. It would be magical, literally. And we don't even have to stop there. Being able to play as Harry Potter would go the extra mile and let us relive the movies even more. We even went and added Ron Weasley into the game and he actually looks pretty awesome. It just shows that if we get a set of the Golden Trio, it would be the perfect way to cross over. But for a collab that was actually leaked, we have one of the most anticipated Fortnite crossovers of Chapter 3, Family Guy. One of the funniest memes in the community right now is seeing Peter Griffin of Fortnite. We've had fake leaks and concepts floating around forever. But last month, Epic Games accidentally leaked that a Family Guy collab was in the works. It's right here on an employee's computer. Well, having Peter Griffin in the game sounds ridiculous. It would make a lot of sense. And let's be honest, the memes will be insane. The internet exploded when Rick and Morty came to the game. Just imagine what Peter Griffin will do. And if you want a skin that doesn't have a Thanos-sized hitbox, then Lois would also look incredible in Fortnite. Now, this model might be a little big, but if we're talking about sizes though, everyone would want Stewie in the game because he's really tiny. They could do something like Mecha Morty, but it would be better just to make him a back bling. Meanwhile, with all these collabs, we want to see some more additions to the Gaming Legends series, and who better than Geralt from The Witcher? And what's crazy is this collab actually has a huge chance of happening thanks to recent news. Epic Games has created a special partnership with CD Projekt Red, the developers of The Witcher. It means that their next game will be made in Unreal Engine, but it could also mean that the door is now open for a Fortnite collab. Fans have been wanting Geralt in the game for a long time, and with The Witcher TV show, the hype has gone up even more. Imagine if they add Roach to the game as a rideable horse. It'd be perfect in Fortnite, and that along with the epic deal makes this one of the most likely crossovers in the video. But something that has an even higher chance of arriving is Miss Marvel. Her new Disney Plus show drops at the very start of next season, and considering we're also getting a Zero War comic, the likelihood of Miss Marvel coming to Fortnite is through the roof. She would look incredible as a skin, and as you can see, it looks like she belongs in the game already. Because the new series lines up perfectly with the launch of Season 3, we could see her in the item shop, or maybe even as a battle pass, 
mask in. But a collaboration that would seriously be impressive might already be in the works. Last year, we were all surprised when Epic Games announced a crossover with League of Legends that brought Jinx and Vi to the game. It made us realize how much was actually possible, and with Epic and Riot Games working together, it opened the door for a crossover with Valorant. The community has been dying to see Valorant skins in Fortnite, and just to showcase how cool this would be, we brought Phoenix into the game. Wait, not this ripoff Phoenix, this Phoenix. People who never played Valorant would probably think he's an original skin. But from games to movies, we of course see one of the most popular film franchises of all time. Fast of the Furious is the perfect crossover to add to Fortnite, not only for the skins, but excuses to add more cars. We could have some insane vehicles added to fit with the collab, like Dom's Dodge Charger. Muscle cars have always been a big part of the movies, and they would be a perfect addition to the vehicles we already have in Fortnite. As for the person driving the car, well, of course, we have to have a Vin Diesel skin. And I mean, come on, Epic is no stranger to adding movie characters to the game, and Vin Diesel as Dominic Toretto is the perfect way to get him in Fortnite. In fact, Vin Diesel even owns his own game company, so a deal could always be setup. We just need some family in Fortnite, okay? Yet even a muscle car wouldn't be as exciting as a different kind of vehicle in game. For, for all of the crazy ways that Epic has let us get around the map, it's surprising that we've never been able to fly around in a fighter jet. And okay, it doesn't have to be this fast, but it would be fun. They could add this as an original vehicle, or they can make it like a Top Gun crossover or something. Either way, we are desperate to see a feature like this in the game. We have all of these Marvel characters, but we still don't have Wanda and Vision. Vision would make for a perfect Fortnite skin, and Wanda looks even better. But there's evidence out there from Epic Games themselves that confirms these characters are coming to the game. When the season began, if you talked to Metal Team leader as Doctor Strange, she'd ask you about Vision. Cool reference on its own, but this week the crossover was pretty much confirmed. In the Fortnite Zero War trailer, you could spot Vision hiding in the background of a scene. And what better way to surprise everyone than with a Mario collab? So we already know that a Mario movie is coming out soon, and if Nintendo could bring him to the big screen, why can't they bring him to Fortnite? A Mario theme POI would be incredible, like Peach's Castle or a Mario Kart feature, maybe even a Mario Mushroom consumable. And while Nintendo are still holding on to their franchises tightly, Riot Games has a lot more to give us. We wouldn't just love Valorant and Fortnite, the Arcane set has plenty of room for new skins. There are so many League of Legends characters that could come to Fortnite, and fans have been wanting to see people like Silco in the game for a long time. Now this is just a concept, but it gets me excited, okay? I'd also love to see Jace in the League of Legends set, I mean, he just really belongs there. And speaking of Arcane, it's not the only Netflix show making waves this year. Stranger Things new season comes out in May, and it's one of the most anticipated shows of the year. The last time we got a Stranger Things season, Fortnite dropped a Demogorgon skin and a Hopper outfit. This time around, who knows what could be in store for us? Some huge characters that are missing from the lineup are Steve Harrington, a fan favorite from the show. We've been wanting to see him in Fortnite for so long, and he could be joined by Nancy Wheeler. Maybe when the next season comes out, the release. And if you're watching this in the future, well, I hope this aged well. And now a collab that everyone has been wanting to see in Fortnite, Crash Bandicoot. While Crash himself might look a little weird as a skin, it wouldn't stop us from getting amazing collab items anyway. Naku Aku Backling would sell extremely well in the item shop, and we could get a POI or LTM that replicates some of the levels from Crash games. Sony is a huge investor in Epic Games, while Microsoft now owns Activision and the rights to Crash Bandicoot. As you know, Microsoft is big on collaborating with people, so nothing is in the way of this happening. Every like on this video shows up at games. We want to see these collabs in games, so make sure to smash like. Hope you guys enjoyed. It's been Tommy, and keep it here on Top 5 Gaming.